There's no life like the good life. Ah, yeah. Sometimes you just gotta get away. So I chose this cold November day for my first hike in the Shenandoah National Park. It was a good chance too to air out the new Mustang on some back mountain roads. There's one nice thing about being back in America, it's the four seasons. After coming from Bahrain where the only season is hot, the autumn colors of these trees is just magnificent. The $30 entrance fee is not so magnificent, but it's the price you pay to get out of the city. Mustang parking. I hated just leaving her on the side of the road like that, but I think she'll get over it. Just go through a little bit of separation anxiety as I head out on the trails now. It's nice being out beyond cell phone reception too. I was on my way to the gym this morning. And I said, you know what, this, I need to get out of here. So in just a two hour drive, here I am in the mountains. It's crazy in America too. It's so easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle and the daily grind. Sometimes you just gotta say tranquilo VFC, tranquilo Vincenzo. It is pretty back here, but I do miss my Cascade Mountains of Washington state. Sometimes you get caught up going so fast, wanting to get to the destination, you forget to just stop, look around, appreciate everything for what it is, the sights, the sounds, the silence, the smells. Someone left dog shit on the side of the trail. After about an hour of walking, here we are at the falls. This is nice, ah uh, yeah. There's no life like the good life, ah uh, yeah. Considering what a beautiful day it was, I was lucky to get this place all to myself. Here's the cave of why they call it Cave Falls too, but the cave is pretty small, it's soft, nothing to explore. Now I rate this hike as easy as shit, with the caveat though that depends on what shape you're in. And there are a bunch of rocky steps leading down, so you just gotta be careful at that point. Now as I'm trying to look cool for my Instagram post, Vinny Cito shriveled up into a short stack of buttons that water's freaking freezing. Very cold. Oh. Ah yeah. Ooh. Now that felt good though. I love it though, just getting away sometimes. When I planned the trip, I hadn't planned on jumping in the water, I just couldn't help myself. Probably scared away some wildlife and hikers when I pulled down my drawers to get in the water and expose that big hairy white Italian ass. I was in no rush to leave either so I just chilled and hung out for a little while and enjoyed the serenity. After a little bit of chill time, I walked about an hour out and there's my beauty waiting for me all patiently and all. I missed you baby. Got in the Mustang and then had to stop and take in some last views before hitting the road where I decided to stop at the Grey Ghost Pinery on the way back. After a day out there hiking, why not stop for a glass or two of wine? Ah yeah. Lots of winery options on the road outside of Shenandoah National Park. It's probably beautiful during the summertime, but I got here just in time to enjoy a glass. The place is really lovely too, nice family owned. And the wine was really, really good. Took a little look around, it's nice and homely and comfortable here, nice place to hang out. But I had the one glass, hit me pretty good since I've been hiking all day, so I got out. Stopped in Washington on the way back. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. VFC's travels on YouTube. Ah uh, yeah.